What's going on YouTube? Did you miss me? It's your guy, Mr. DCYLP. All right, now today we're going to talk about portrait art. All right, using portrait art for your brand. So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how I took one of my favorite pictures of Rihanna and turn it into some major portrait art. And we're going to talk about that right after my intro. <laughs> So, like I was saying, I used a, what I consider to be a classic picture of Rihanna that was taken back in 2017. She was just awarded uh, the Humanitarian of the Year via uh, the Harvard Foundation. And, you know, she was just sitting in a chair, you know, in, uh, you know, regular clothes. As you can see, she got the ripped up jeans. You know, she's styling in her Timberlands. You know, she got a white T-shirt on and um, a blazer over that. You know, just, you know, some some red lipstick, not too dark. You know what I'm saying? She had her hair just, as you can see, she got her hair tied up, you know, in a, in a ponytail. Just like real, like chill, like B-girl status. You know what I'm saying? No no over excessive uh, weave or extensions. You know, she's just chilling in, in, in the chair being herself, looking all beautiful. All right, now. Um, I switched it up a little bit, and uh, you guys will see when we go up in the lab and I press up these uh, these sweatshirts. All right, I went with super color again, as far as you know the transfers, because I feel like super color is going to give me exactly what I'm looking for uh, with this particular project. You know, I, I wanted to create like art, but something that's like could be considered like quote unquote like a, a piece of high fashion for my own particular brand. All right, my we major uh, lineup. The t-shirt that she's wearing says, we should all be feminists, all right? So that quote is by uh, um, Maria Grazi. She did the, we should all be uh, feminist collection for Dior back in um, 2017. And at the time, these, these plain basic white, T-shirts were, you know, they were starting off selling for seven hundred and ten dollars a piece. I seen them get as high as like eighteen hundred dollars, but that's here nor there. It's not about them; it's about the actual photo. I don't know who actually took this photo of Rihanna sitting in the chair, but I truly appreciate them for doing that. All right, now I feel like, you know, you have like your your classic photos of quote unquote. Uh, famous people from the past that to this day are considered like a piece of art and uh you know who's ever minds like you take like you take like uh, a picture of like Merlin Monroe like back in the day she was considered like you know, I don't know at the time one of the most beautiful you know women in the world all right now uh the picture the painting of Mona Lisa Everybody goes crazy over this painting of Mona Lisa. All right, and and, and, and speaking of Mona Lisa, I'm, I'm actually gonna call this particular piece uh, Mona Lisa 2 with the number 200 on the back end. And it's just a play off of words saying, okay, well, if you consider this to be art and her to be beautiful, but don't forget about us because we're beautiful too. Mona Lisa 2. But I'm rocking out with my girl Rihanna, baby. All right, my girl Rihanna gonna be the uh, the face for this joint. All right, now, um, even like portraits, like classic joints where like Michael Jordan is, you know, got that classic photo of Jordan just leaning from the, you know, from the from the foul line, about to, you know, dunk the ball, or uh, pictures like, uh, you know, what's hot, you know, what's hot. That Lil' Kim Hardcore al uh, album cover where, you know, she's, you know, kneeling down, you know, uh, you know, in a seductive position. Nicki, Nicki Minaj uh, tried to uh, recreate it. She did all right. But I feel like, you know, even that, that could be like, I mean, if you're into that, 
if you want to consider that particular uh, photo art, you could put that up on your wall, or if you want to, or you could turn that into, uh, you could put that on uh, a garment and, you know, pretty much freak it like I'm doing with this particular piece. All right, so, I mean, I know I'm ranting on and on, but that's where I was at when I started thinking about what I wanted to do with this actual photo. And as you can see, I put the We Made You all the way around the image and I crossed out her, I crossed out her eyes and um, at the bottom, I crossed out on her t-shirt, I crossed out feminist and I put major saying that, you know, we should all, you know, be major because we major, baby, you, me, us. All right, so I ain't gonna keep raining on and on about um, the actual photo. I'm gonna take y'all up in the lab and I'm gonna get this application and uh, we're gonna see how they come out. On the right sleeve, you know, I'm gonna put my leather, uh, my leather patch and um, on the shorts on the bottom left leg, I'm gonna put the, the leather patch as well. And I just know on this white, it's gonna come out so beautiful. I'm thinking about hitting, uh, uh, I might drop in the red too, but as of right now, we're gonna focus on this white. All right, and I'm gonna try to dress this thing up on the back end to let y'all see, you know, how I would style it when I'm about to rock this joint, all right? Cause it could be versatile. So I'm gonna show y'all, you know, some few versatile flavors, accessories that you could rock with this joint and still look, you know, you know, classy, but just comfortable and sharp at the end of the day. However you want to do it, baby. All right, let's go. All right, y'all, so we up in the lab. Um, these are transfers, okay? Now, I didn't go with the wearables this time. I went with a uh, soft shell blocker. See that? All the applications on what we have to do. Soft shell blocker says its use is for soft shell jackets with less stretch. Okay. Now the press temp is 285 degrees Fahrenheit to 300. Pressure time, 10 to 15 seconds. Y'all know I always go with uh, the highest temp and the highest amount of seconds. So I'm going to be pressing these joints up at 300 for 15 seconds. Okay. Just look at that transfer, man. <laughs> like, super color ain't no joke, man. Like, hold on. Like... At this point, you know, we might as well give Supercolor their uh, their flowers, man. It is what it is. They're the best. All right, now this va this backing, I don't know what this whole backing is about. Backing feels like real texture heavy, so we'll see how it comes out on these uh, sweatshirts. I got a nice all-white 80% cotton. 20% uh, polyester crew neck here. I already put the leather patch on the sleeve. Y'all didn't seen these before. No reason for me to show you the application on that. We done been, we done been down that road. And if you don't know how I do those, go in my last videos and um, see how I applied it. All right. But let's get this joint pressed up, man. So we can actually see. I got the shorts over here too. So here's the white shorts. Just like the crew neck, I already put the leather patch on the left leg. So let's get this thing pressed up. So I'm only showing you guys this if you're thinking about using some type of portrait art for your brand. Okay, like I said, 
I'm not the first to do it. There's been others, you know, out there that have done it. You know, when you go to a concert, you go to a concert, you know, these, these performers make all this merch with, you know, their their logos on them or their, their faces or their uh, their whole crew or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's all screen printed though, but Super Color can do that shit too and we'll prove it right now. Don't ever think you can't do what these big time brands are doing. Trust me, you can do it. You just gotta do your research and follow my channel. All right, so that was 15 seconds, hot pill. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. Y'all see this? Come on, y'all. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see this crew neck, man? Now, if y'all didn't know who I was, right, and you walked up into, like, Versace, you know what I'm saying, Gucci, Dior, Fendi, and this was laying up on the rack for 1500 you mean to tell me these people that are into this high fashion ain't gonna cop this because they're gonna say, oh, wow. That's fire. I ain't seen that before. What that means? That movie major. Come on, man. Anything is possible. Just try out Super Color. Like I said, I went with the, the soft shell blocker this time. This is my first time using a soft shell blocker. I like the way it feels. Normally, I go with the wearables. So, we'll see how this thing holds up. I mean, I ain't hard pressed. I already know what it is. This is beautiful, man. This is a beautiful crew neck. All right, so before this video ends, like I said, I'm gonna go throw this joint on. We're gonna see how it looks on body. But y'all make sure y'all hit that thumbs up. Make sure y'all hit that bell so y'all never miss any of my new latest and greatest content. So once again, this, this video was pretty much to show you that you can use portraits for your brand as well. Um, if you're going to do so, I would say to go with Super Color. It's the cheapest best option available right now okay now that's super color all right check them out if you haven't done that yet all right so i'm gonna go back down to the studio throw this joint on give you some variations with some accessories and y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments all right let's get it all right so for the first look you know you show up with something like this it's all about, you know, the accessories. You know, I got the little, nice little white gold, you know, Cuban on right now. Something light, you know, all black frames. Got the black snap back. You know, we popping up at the club or something with your, with your, with your boys or something. You know, trying to go out and bag something impressive. Ladies, something like this is, you know, real nice flavor before hit the bar or something. All right, then you switch it up. Then you go with the big man on campus look. I'm saying you in, you in, you in school. You trying to impress the ladies, you know what I'm saying? You letting them know you're going to be successful in life. You got your little gold dripping, you know what I'm saying? Something like you got your gold frames, you know, nice little camper hat on. You know, you trying to you trying to make a statement like, yo, I'm out here, man. Like, you know, what's good? Hey, what's good with you, shorty? You looking real good over there. You see your boy? Yeah, I'll get with you later, though. Yeah, I want that. You know what I'm saying? Something like got your, you know, your book bag. You know, you stunting on them. Got Rihanna, juice dripping. You know, it's another look. Now, next you come back on some super fly OG shit. On some I came through the door. I said it before. I never let the mic magnetize me no more. 
know what I'm saying? Come through with the dookie on. You know, got the fedora popping. You know, nice little square frames. You know? Another option for y'all. Just multiple options, baby. Like I said, accessorize. However you want to do it. But the, the joint still look wild elegant. You know, show up at the... Ooh. Ooh, I got, oh, I got y'all. Hold on real quick. Show up like this when those all white parties start popping off again. You know what I'm saying? Or you want to take your lady out, you know, for her birthday or, or, or Mother's Day or something like that. You come through <laughs> with the shades on, hat. Come on, baby. So once again, man, like always, I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video. I know it's been, I know it's, 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 it's long and stretched out. But hey, I just wanted to show y'all how versatile this full frontal portrait image can be. All right. Till next time, like I always say, I hope you're working hard on your brand because I'm working hard on mine, baby. Until next time, let's get it. The message is always in the cloth, the colors, the designs, the fit. Basically, pay attention, stay alert, and remember choose your own path.